up kids? Wicked here with another Hardcore with a G Let's Play of Bella's Mansion. Uh, last time we played we got chased by a like psycho alien looking zombie. We got a sword. We still don't really know the mystery of the sword but hopefully we'll find out maybe. Um, and then we found another safe room. So hopefully you guys remember we found some tear shaped jewels too. So I'm going to try to find a place where those go. Uh, so without further ado let's just get right back into it okay? Boop. I didn't, I didn't have my hand on the keyboard. <laughs> I didn't realize he'd be so close. Oh my God, there's, so I already went south. I want to see if there's anything else south. Oh, oh God, I'm cornering myself here. Oh God. Fight. I don't see a way to fight with the sword. Ah, all right. Bummer. Well, we have the sword. I did save it since we got the sword. We got the jewels. Um, yeah, nothing's happened since we saved other than reading that text document. And it was fairly long, so I'm gonna go rush up there and read it really quick and get those CD-ROMs. Uh, and we'll skip forward to that so you guys don't have to see all that again. All right, I got it. I read that document. I'm so tempted to save it just so I don't have to keep reading it if I die again, but no, I'm not going to make that mistake again. All right, let's try to go west. Ooh, God, this better be open. Ooh, let's look around first. Ooh, is this where I'm supposed to kill myself, like in the note? What do you think first, the note or the shiny? There's a text document. We'll do the note first. October 30th, so yesterday, I guess. Uh, the mansion's water supply is still looking fine, despite the high requirements of our guests and the project itself. I'm very happy we were able to locate this cave with that large river flowing into it. It makes this, idea, uh, this area ideal for maintaining the mansion's water supply. Several dead animals have begun to appear within the water, but luckily our water treatment plant is doing a fine job of removing anything harmful from the water. I have a feeling that sparkly in the water is gonna be a monster. Uh, I just hope it stays stable and doesn't malfunction like it did last week. It would be terrible if it did. Oh, fantastic. Okay. Okay, do I look? Looks like there's something in the water when you try to get it out. I think it's a trap, but yes. Wow, what do we have here? CD-ROMs? You've taken the combat sword. Wait, what? Nice, maybe now I could do something about those zombies. Gee, I almost feel sorry for what's about to happen to them. How do I use it? Do I just walk into them? Why was there a sword in the water in the first place? Oh. Um, it doesn't seem to be doing anything. Just wondering what the button would be. Sorry, guys. I'm expecting like a swing or something. At this point, I think I should still be evading them. Should I? Oh, God. Wow, they're really coming for me. Let's reset them. And save. No! Okay, that's definitely not doing anything for me. I'm gonna save it. Uh, and heal, at least. I've gotten fairly familiar with where to go around here. Get away from me, though. I don't know if this sword is doing it. It didn't seem to, look, I'm in danger. It doesn't seem to be doing anything. There's got to be a button to use it, right? And I, it's not, I don't have a menu. Shit, I'm cold again, too. I don't think I actually have to go back to that area at all. Unless there is something south. Um, 
watch me having saved at the most opportune time or something. I'm gonna heat up real quick. God, this is such, oh, I mean, it, yes, it's a mansion, I get that, but holy moly. I still don't have anything to open that microwave. Hmm. Let me check these doors again really quick. This was just that weird hallway. It led to like the other areas. Um, that's the, up there is the kitchen. This is a green one. And this leads to that library, right? <gasps> Which actually I have not gone. I hope I don't have to go back in there. That's where the alien thing was before. It's probably not in there anymore. Wait. I wonder if I can go in the door above uh, where he came out. I did just save it, so. What am I supposed to do with this combat door? Are you still in here? Ooh. A uh, hallway. Get away from me. Where's this go? Where is this? Okay. Oh, this is where I wanted to go. Okay. What's south? Uh huh. Mm. <laughs> Bella, let's go home. Uh, that growl sounded loud, angry, and hungry. Something's in this room. I have a combat sword. Maybe now we'll get to use it. Or we'll just run. I did something! I killed something! Okay. Wow, this little sword is strong. I'm glad I picked it up when I did. <gasps> oh, okay. I'm at warning, though. Can I use it for... <gasps> I f have figured it out. Oh, I feel so much better. Oh, I'm sorry about the keyboard though, guys. A medium herb here. Yes, I will use it, actually. Okay, that's not a replenishing one, huh? <laughs> Can I break barrels? No. Okay, let's start here. <gasps> There's a girl in this one. Oh my God, and a fire. Who are you? Let's see, who is this? Tech document, sure. October 21st. Oh, this is a while ago. At last, I have finished preparing this fine mansion for the upcoming government project. Oh, so this project's only been going on for like two weeks. Uh, not even. The vast amounts of funding we have received from the government have allowed us to rebuild ruined rooms that were previously destroyed, reconnect the mansion's power systems, and prepare safe areas to keep our guests and subjects separated. This mansion shall serve as one of the many places where this project can function, successfully without fear of any issue. <laughs> October 31st. <laughs> well, I'm not afraid to admit it. Even I'm wrong on occasion. A simple miscalculation is all it took for the project to backfire in our faces. Now most of the mansion is lost. Our security force is almost completely wiped out, and most of the guests have become terrifying zombies. It's simply a gigantic mess. My friend has already killed himself in the hopes that we he will not return as one of those undead creatures. Perhaps I should consider the same. After all, there is no hope for this mansion anymore. And I really don't want to make any more mistakes. What's this? A bone? It appears to be some kind of bone. It's milky white. Sure, I'll take it. I'm going to look around first. I see you there, lady. Is there something... Oh, there's something shiny on that barrel down there. I thought she was moving. Let's just see. I am ecstatic about the prospect of finding more CDs still even though I can I'm so happy I can kill things now so you just have to hit the action button in front of them and I thought I was I thought I was mashing it quite a bit but I think I was getting damaged when I did they were on top of me already so but that's awesome feel much better about it hi you look exactly like me except blue hair who who are you you're not one of the other guests calm down I'm not a zombie I'm Bella. Who might you be? And what the hell is going on around here? I like how she says, I'm Bella. Like, just, you know, 
Like, she should know who she is. I came in here to get out of the storm, and it's crawling with zombies. I'm Melody. Nice to meet you. Oh, we read a diary entry from you. If I knew how all this started, I'd feel a lot better, but I don't have a clue either. By the time I figured out what was happening, the whole mansion was overrun by crazy zombies. And on top of that, some strange green super mutant monster thing has been going around wrecking the whole place. Yeah, I, I saw it. I wonder if my sword can kill it. Nice to meet you too, Melody. That's a pretty name. Wait, a monster? Are you sure? Uh, yeah. Yes. I don't know how, but I'm pretty sure that's how this whole mess started. That thing turned the other guests and guards into zombies. I called my best friend to come and save me. He's a soldier in the army, you know. But I'm so scared. I don't think I'm going to get out of here alive. I don't want to die. Not here. Not in this place. She seems to be pretty scared. Hey, chin up. Everything will be all right. <laughs> mm. I know we'll get out of here in one piece. We just have to be strong. Come with me. Are you sure? Sure. You'll see. But right now, maybe you should go find somewhere to hide. Are you sure? I'm sure. I'll take care of things around here. You need to stay safe for now. Just go find somewhere to hide, all right? Thank you. There's something in that barrel. I was trying to reach, but I can't. I saw it shining in there. Maybe you can get it out. She's gonna die. Sorry, Melody, bye. Nice knowing ya. Melody, huh? Why does that name sound so familiar? And she seems like a nice enough kid. Too nice to end up in a hellhole like this. But what did she mean by green super mutant monster thing? You'll know it when you see it. <laughs> okay. I bet it's going to appear when I get out of here too. Small key, will you take it? Yes. Okay. I kind of... Uh... Just waiting for it to come find me. Oh. It doesn't want anything to do with me now. <laughs> that is very gratifying now that I can do that. Uh, so, what door did I come in? Oh, <laughs> I thought I was on the other side. You know, considering I was on the edge and all. You bastard! See, it's very finicky. Shoot, I would really like to save it again. <laughs> Where does this go? Uh, nowhere that I want to be. Just oh, they respawn. Okay. Um. I was pressing it. I'm sure you guys heard it. Okay, shiny. Where was it? Here. Small key. Yeah. A note. Warning. Arctic storage room ahead. Remember to wear special protection against the extreme cold. Oh, I don't like that at all. Is that this? Whoa, there's a lot here. And they all want me dead. I have to like start pressing it way ahead of time. Doors bolted shut. Okay, well we know what that means. Can't go in there. I'm not gonna go in there yet till I get a snowsuit or something. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Okay. It's locked. A small key lock. Sure. Maybe there's a safe room. Oh, I don't like this at all. There's a gem, but I have a feeling he's going to come get me. And if that's the case, I need to heal. This guy's fast. Sorry, I know the keyboard's probably really obnoxious, guys. I just, playing with the controller was not working at all for this particular game. Yeah, I'm gonna level up. I would like an herb. <laughs> okay. 
I'm not even gonna try in here. Oh god. Well, I think there's one. Oh god. I think there's one level above this. I think there's a danger level too. Let's save it. Wait, how many do I have? I only have two. Uh, I feel like a lot's happened, so I, I'm gonna save it. Alrighty, so I'm trying to remember where we haven't gone yet. We have a ton of uh, tear-shaped jewels, and I actually, I don't recall seeing any doors that required that yet, so. You sound. I'm gonna kinda go back to the beginning and see if there's anything I missed. Cause I'm starting to kinda lose track. Did I look around here? Oh wait. Oh, a small herb. No. Let's just try to remember that it's there. I already checked this room. Yeah. I feel so happy that I can uh, kill kill things now. So I actually, I'm in. I have to say, I'm enjoying this game much more now. Um, that's the thing. It's it's not. I'm, I'm warming up. Uh, it's not difficult. It's just there's something about the mechanic of them damaging you that when he, they hit you, I would get stuck. I would try to run away. I would instantly press the opposite direction. I wouldn't go anywhere, and I would just get locked in there. I think once or twice I've been able to get away after when I'm taking damage, but. Most of the time I get locked into place, which is what my frustration was all about, honestly. I really was enjoying the game and the story, and I really want to know what's going on. That was frustrating. Now that I have a sword, I feel a little bit better. What about in here? Was the... Okay, well, I'll just go. Was the other one a tear-shaped, or was it green? A green one. Let me see if I could look around here a little bit more if I kill these. I'm just trying to play it as if uh, one hit will kill me because I do get locked into place sometimes. Now that I have the sword, I'm actually really excited. Um, so I don't know if the developer will ever see this or not. I am really interested in the game. I really like it so far. I definitely got frustrated. I don't know if it was my computer or what. I was just getting locked into place and having to backtrack so many times was just frustrating. So what is this one again? Is this the one that was bolted from the other side? I think so. Which means I haven't explored in here. Let me just double check. Can I get this herb? No. <laughs> oh wait. It was the one that was and then it spits me out back here. Which is actually, I'll try to remember the shortcuts like that. Um, that's really nice because I, I wanted to go back there. Um, I wanted to come back here. So that's the library. What is this again? I don't know. Um, and then this up here is the kitchen. Let me see if I could do anything in there yet. Okay. I wonder if... I can't help but feel like that axe has got to be for a reason. I wonder if I run into a, somebody who is stronger and I could get, like, lead them to that. I probably already explored in here. Let's see. Well, to check, you need a crowbar. Okay, still need a crowbar. What's that? Oh, I guess it's the faucet. It looked like a key. I was gonna say, don't tell me I missed a key in this little area here. I bet, I bet I run into that army guy or something, and he needs a weapon, which is a cool idea. But I don't see why she can't pick it up if a man can pick it up. Anyway, <laughs> I already checked all these. And I'm sorry for anyone who's getting really sick. What is this? The fire room? Yeah. Um, for anyone who's getting sick of all the backtracking. This is a quite a um, elaborate mansion. I am not very good with directions in the first place. I'm very, like, spatially challenged. Um, I'm so, I'm intrigued by these shelves that look different. I'm sure it's just on purpose. Um, the both of these were green. So let's just kind of walk through... This was the door with the switches. Was there anything else beyond this? No, 
no. I got... No. Oh, I can't go in there. That's where all the zombies were. I got that jewel and then they all appeared. So I can't go back in there. <laughs> I love it. I'm just being very cautious because I, I still seem to get locked in the place a little bit. Um, that one I need a green. Where, where else? That's the fire room. So I guess it's got to be back in that big giant area. What was this again? The tunnel? Yeah, I don't need to go back here ever again. <laughs> I don't want to ever see that room again. All right, so we'll make our way back. Now that I have the sword, I feel like I can actually look at things a little bit more. Before I was just panicking and running away from everything. Oh, God. <laughs> I didn't know what to do in that situation. Okay, what was west of this? I seem to remember being not liking it and running out. Oh no, I got the sword here. See, I told you I'm bad with directions. Come on, idiot. Come here. Oh, he got me. It looks like he like makes a little face when he gets me. Like his face changes a little bit. Ooh. Down here was this room and below this. Maybe I should look around here a little bit more. I mean, that pot was very obvious, but... Come here, you. Oh, man. You know what? No. <laughs> Let's see if I can remember. This went to that passageway over the water. Uh, 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 over the shoot, I forgot they respawn. I don't know if I tried to go over here. Oops, you're kind of quick. Come on. What was this? This leads back out to the library. Okay. Oh, I looked here. I think. So it's got. Ooh. It's got to be that big room that was past this that had a lot of doors to it. But I don't remember seeing any tear-shaped ones. Oh, I was trying to look at the plant, but okay. So, let's... I probably do have to go in the freezer. What's this again? Oh, I have not been in here. Oh, you're waiting for me? This one I went in. Oh, might as well heat up. Alrighty. So I'll keep that as a mental note. Uh, I gotta remember not to rush up these hallways because, like, the, the interface of the temp and all that. Um, what was this again? Oh. I think that's a shortcut, too. Let's do this room first. Although I feel like I'm gonna get chased. Especially after finding that one. You place the two. Oh, is this where they go? So I need eight of them. That's why I haven't seen any doors like that. That would make sense. I kind of feel, this looks very much like towards the end, I would say. Oh man, am I going to be on a tear jewel hunting? Oops. <laughs> Let me just look in here. It's pretty common knowledge that when there's a room like this, there's a tear jewel in here. But I don't think there is this time. Also, I don't think I'm... Oh. If behind this door you wish to see, bring me my blue tears three. There's something scribbled below. By three, whoever wrote this meant eight. Because I count eight stands in this room. Vaca. Okay. I don't know how many I have. I think I have three. Um, shut tight mode open. I see that there's eight, but I bet, I mean, if the note says three, I bet it's three. But I don't know where to put them. I hope I can take it out once I... Oh, I can't take it. 
So I guess I do need eight, maybe. I can't take it back. I'm an idiot. Okay. Oh, stop meeting me by the thing. Um, so where's, okay, I knew there was another one. So I need to really find five. Oh, I wasn't prepared. Okay. Oh, all right, let's try that again. I looked in here, right? Or did I'm I'm losing track of what rooms I've been in since I got the sword. I know I didn't look around much, but when I didn't have the sword, because I was too panicked. Where did this lead again? Oh yeah. Come on. Oh yeah, the Arctic room. Where's this? This one, which I did not want to go in yet. Oh, you jerk. I don't have any protective clothing. I, well, I, I bet it just means it goes down really fast. So let's just be, well, let's do this one first. And then I just, let me see. I just need to plan ahead and know where the nearest fireplace is. Ugh. What was this again? Okay. I don't want to go, that my, my temperature is going to drop extremely quick in there, obviously. Um, I just, I don't know the lay of the land as well as I'd like. So let me kind of map out, I won't, I'll cut this out for you guys, but I'm going to just map out the way to the nearest fireplace before I do this. All right, guys, we're going to go in the cold room now that I know exactly how to get back to the fireplace room. Oh, maybe we're not going to go in it. There's a white skull and carved. Empty holes below it indicate something belonged there. Oh, like bones? Looks like you can't get this open right now. Oh, so I need both bones. Okay. Well, so much of a build-up for that. All right, well, let's see if um, grabbing this makes the guy come. Yep. I've got almost all of these things by now. I don't think I do. <gasps> mm, not this guy. <gasps> oh my god, you almost got <laughs> Did not like. <laughs> Man, I don't like aliens. Nope. And I'm at caution. Oh, I still can't get this open. <sighs> I really want to save again, guys. Oh, whoops. So that I need another bone for. <laughs> oh, God. Okay. Just being overly cautious. It does say caution on my health things for a reason, so I'd love to find... <sighs> It's kind of irritating because I know there was an herb around here somewhere that I said, oh, I'll save that for when I need it, and I don't remember where it is. This is a fireplace room. There's normally herbs in here, but... You know what? Maybe I'll make my way back to the safe room and at least get an herb before I leave this here because it says she, she thinks I have almost all of them, which I don't think I do, but... Something noisy going on upstairs. So I'm gonna go just to the safe room just to use one of those herbs. I'm not. I'm not gonna save it, even though I want. I want to. They're uh, tricky little buggers. There we go. Just gotta wait it out. Herb, I love you. Yay! Um, so actually, I think this episode might be a little short. I don't know, but I'm going to call it good here just because we're in the safe room um, and I have some stuff to do before I carry on. So, hope you guys are enjoying it. If you want to give the game a try, uh, there's a link in the description so you can try it. It is free, uh, and it is a lot of fun. It's a little tricky in the beginning, but it is a lot of fun. It is very Resident Evil-esque, which the developer said it was, and I like that. 
Um, but anyway, if you guys liked the video, please subscribe to the channel and share it with your friends. We really appreciate it. And I will be back with another Hardcore with a G Let's Play soon.